recommended motion is that the, the board approve the superintendent contract for Michael Notar as presented. So moved. Second. The Connecticut School Board met briefly June 10th to name a new superintendent. He is Michael Notar, most recently superintendent in Warren and, before that, Brookfield. He will make $97,000 this year, $98,500 the next year, and an even $100,000 the third year. Yes. Mr. Pofan? Yes. And Mr. Newcomb? Yes. Notar may provide an in to get Connaught into a sports conference as well. Uh, currently, right now, I live in the Youngstown area. I've been uh, finishing my fourth year in the Warren City School District. I was the uh, business manager there, the high school principal, in the last two years serving as the superintendent of schools. Uh, moving up here, yeah, currently looking at uh, uh, actually meet with my realtor tomorrow. So we're going to take a look at uh, you know putting my house up for sale where I live and and start to look for something up in this area. Uh, just excited to get going, you know, get in and, and start working with the building principals and the teachers, taking a look at where we are uh, academically as a district and start the, start the process of moving the district forward. Um, you know, it's always, I've, uh, you know, the last couple of years I spent some time looking for a district that would be a great fit for me both personally and professionally. Um, and meeting with the board and interviewing with them, I knew it was a perfect fit for uh, myself as well as my family, so I'm looking forward to it. It's a uh, very similar to a district I grew up and graduated from in, in Trumbull County, so uh, it, it's nice to, to come to an area where there's a hometown atmosphere, there's a lot of tradition and so forth, so I'm looking forward to it. Um, when I was the uh, superintendent at Brookfield, I was part of the, one of the superintendents when the All-American Conference was formed. And uh, in the last two years, being a superintendent at Warren City Schools, we successfully moved out of the Lake Erie League and into the All-American Conference. So I'll begin those conversations with those superintendents to see if they would uh, give Connie out of consideration to move it into that league. Uh, one of the first things, once I come on, I'll take a look at where we are financially. I'll take a look at what, we're, uh, what we currently have staffing-wise, program-wise, things of that nature. It's, it's best to evaluate the district from top to bottom um, before we go ahead and make a, a quick decision. So it's any other school district. We're in the same circumstances in the district that I'm currently uh, leaving. So uh, all school districts, they face financial situations eventually. So it's just a matter of evaluating everything from top to bottom and making the correct decisions and moving forward. Where do you start? Uh, officially August 1st. Oh. Yeah, yeah. So do you have a family? Or? Yeah, I have two, two, two uh, children. I have a son that just turned 17 and a daughter that is uh, 13. She'll turn 14 here in a couple months. So, yeah, they keep me busy. Notar replaces retiring superintendent Kent Houston. The board also hired Daniel Summers as band director at $38,508 per year. We all ought to welcome both our new employees. We'll come out. Looking at uh, uh, actually meet with my realtor tomorrow, so we're going to take a look at uh, you know putting my house up for sale where I live and and start to look for something up in this area.